thought I'd show some of my 2000 AD small miniatures that I've collected over the years. They're mainly from Foundry Miniatures in Nottingham and I thought, thought I'd start with my Strontium dogs. And I'm thinking this is the very first one I did. It's Johnny Alpha of course. Um, and it's Johnny Alpha but he's on a different base. Um, all the figures come with their own cast, tiny little featureless little bases. This, I think, is a Games Workshop base. I can't really remember, but I think it was. But with some added bits and pieces just to disguise um, the, the plain base. Some scattered material put over the top. As I say, this is the first one that I did. And it's one of those cases of what looks good in the comics doesn't really look that good when it starts going on a 3D form. It's hard. Johnny Alpha's outfit especially is pretty garish and that looks all right as I say in the prog but it looks a bit toy like um, but you know green is green yellow is yellow orange is orange there's not a lot you can do about it I didn't want to make it too dark though and go like a Brian Singer X-Men type look so I had to select a green I had to select a yellow I toned down the oranges and I made them more browny, seeing as the orange bits are um, body armour. But I kept the helmet, I wanted that a nice bright yellow, and I went for a mid-green. So as I say, that, that's my first one, that's Johnny Alpha, put him over there. Um, next up, let's go with the Torso, who's a great 80s Strontium Dog character. With these supporting characters, sometimes it was kind of hard to, to find a colour scheme for them. And I think with the torso, there was one cover of the prog where he was in orange and white, which is kind of nice. It's not too garish. Um, I quite like the uh, white contrast to the orange. And he's a great character, you know, he's called the torso for a reason. Um, kind of difficult, I don't know if you can pick that out, but to do that eye was a bit of a bastage. But, yeah. So that's the torso. Just put him next to Johnny there. Like so. And next, another great character. Coming back time and time again. Evans the Fist. There he goes. Um, again, I found a colour scheme on a on a cover, but it's not doing it for me. I, I, I followed it because that's what it was like, but blue and red. Evans, what are you thinking? Next up we've got Durham Red. Um, I really like Durham Red, well, the original West Squarea version of Durham Red. And I would like to have got a figure. And it's all right. Strange pose. Face is okay, I guess. Colour scheme was pretty good. She's all like chain mail, really. But, I don't know, face could have been better. Pose could have been better. And my last one is another Johnny Alpha. This time, as you can see, I it was quite a way down the line, and I decided, okay, I'm not going to do the oranges this time. I'm going to go full out, you know, green and yellow. And I actually prefer it now. I prefer it. I know it's a bit toy-like, but at this scale, I think it works. And it definitely for him to him. So that's it, they're my strontium dogs. I should get a wolf sometime. Should get a gronk I suppose. So hmm.